Hey YouTube, welcome to another video from Skinny Medic. Wanted to give you some information on the Ebola virus going around. Um, I posted a link on my Facebook page and there's been some information going about. So uh, I just wanted to help share the information that I know about it and try to help inform you guys. First of all, this is a virus that's been around for a while. It's been around like 1976. So this isn't something new. This isn't something that just popped up out of nowhere. It's actually been around for a little bit, but all of a sudden we're seeing a big increase in it. And it's actually running pretty rapid uh, across West Africa right now, and it has a very high mortality rate. Um, information I'm seeing is about 90% mortality rate. So it's actually uh, killing some of the healthcare workers. I know it took uh, the life of one doctor down there that was heading up research, uh, trying to figure out a treatment plan. So uh, this is a very deadly virus. So the good thing about this type of virus is though that it's not airborne. Okay, it doesn't pass from one person breathing on another person or coughing um, so it's more of a body fluid so I guess you could like cough mucus but um, like sweat sexually transmitted disease um, stuff like that is how it's going to be transmitted so thank goodness this is not an airborne uh, virus so it should be contained into West Africa since they are quarantining uh, those individuals with high fevers and that's going to be your initial onset. So the signs of symptoms of the Ebola virus are going to be uh, flu-like symptoms. You're going to get a high-grade fever. Uh, you're going to have nausea and vomiting and diarrhea. Unfortunately right now there's no treatment. There's no cure for it. So it does have a high mortality rate. So if it does hit the United States, which I really don't think so, I think it's just, you know, just to be cautious, um, I would start treating with the symptoms and signs, you know, start treating the patient for your high grade fever, uh, start treating them for the nausea and vomit and diarrhea, make sure they don't, they do not get dehydrated. So I would kind of uh, treat the symptoms if, if I were treating a patient with this virus. So until they can come out with a cure. So uh, just kind of give you some education, some background on this information on this Ebola virus. Uh, we'll keep an eye out on it, but they are quarantining uh, those several cities in West Africa. So hopefully they going to quarantine it too. doesn't spread. So thank you guys for watching. If you know more information or you've got some information you want to add, please comment on this video and please share it. Thank you guys for watching. You never know when you'll be the first responder.